Nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. Bye, guys. Bye. Thanks. Wow, Gloria, you made their day. That's so sweet. Oh, I drive carefully. <laughs> that was amazing, though, because everybody who heard you were coming on the stoop had the same reaction. I love her. Oh. People say, I love her. They don't say, oh, I'm a fan or great me, but I love her. I'm fortunate enough to have some super loyal fans through the years. I've made that relationship. It was important for me. When I'm in concert, I don't want them to just go and hear music. So it was really important to connect, and you can connect. Talk to them, just be a normal human being and you know, joke with them and always sign autographs. I've never refused that and give them hugs. People come up to me in the streets of New York and go, I just want a hug. Oh, wow. And that's such a great feeling. Why would, that's such an interesting thing for them well, to want is to hug. I think they went through a very tough time with me. The accident happened on snow-covered Interstate 380. She was rushed by ambulance to nearby Community Medical Center in Scranton, where doctors say she suffered a broken back. When this happened to me, I actually thought, you know what? Maybe this is the reason that I got the fame. Maybe I can help people by watching, having them watch me go through this experience and come back from something that, you know, they said well, I'd never walk again, and I did. They said I'd never get on stage again, and I did. They said I'd never have another baby, and I did. So it's kind of maybe they feel what became, it went beyond fandom then to like a human connection when they saw me go through that situation, I think. Okay, so let's rewind. You have seven Grammys under your belt. Thank you so much. Ponga, Get On Your Feet, One, Two, Three, really big songs, right, that brought that Latin rhythm into American mainstream. So there you are, you're at the height of it all. You get in this devastating bus crash. So someone walks in the room and says, sorry, Gloria, no more walking, no more dancing, no more performing. When you heard that, what was it? Well, I could feel people's prayers, like a physical energy in my hospital room. And Emilio would walk in crying and everybody would walk in crying. And I knew, because I could feel everybody's prayers. It was weird. Yeah. It's connection, it's human connection and it's very powerful. Had I ended up in a chair, okay, I could still write. Because you move forward and if, if it's inevitable and you gotta deal with it, you deal with it. But I was not gonna take that for an answer. You know. Is there a most important line of music you've ever written? Is there a most important lyric? You know what? I don't know if most important, but there's a few songs that I love that have been out there. There's songs that kind of came through me. Coming Out of the Dark is one of them. Uh, the opening line of that, Why Be Afraid If I'm Not Alone. And it actually closes and wraps up our Broadway play. It's really? called On Your Feet. And it's about. Us, my husband, me, the career, actually, it's about, it's a human story. Is there anything you've learned about yourself by watching the play about your life that you didn't know before? The moment where my daughter and I wrote the original tune for the play, where my mom comes to the hospital after she hadn't spoken to me for two years because I took my sister on the road and she got really pissed. This is like a telenovela. Yeah, it is, it is yeah. actually. <laughs> Aren't our lives like a telenovela? Hell yeah. Yes, they are. <laughs> so yeah, you, that kind of thing. You see it from a kind of uh, third person perspective. And it's it, wild. It's interesting. Listen, I don't see any sign of you slowing down, whether yeah. it's more music, more Broadway, more whatever. We've got I'm music just... coming up, new music. We do. Oh yeah? Yeah, I do. You want to give me a little preview? Uh, I mean, let's just say it's going to be very Brazilian. Brasileira, yes. ay, pura vida, mi amor. Yes, that's going to be awesome. Cheers. And I'm very excited. Cheers to that. Cheers to that.